Hey everybody, Carby Susan, welcome. We're going to do the uh, Heritage Six Box eBay number eight right now. Come this way. Oops. Long scene. Do this one exactly as we did. Who do who do you have in it? Uh, Lots of Red Sox. Terry, how are you doing tonight? I guess it's still evening. It's still light outside here. <clears throat> Excuse me, doing all right. Wife's a little sick, so that's not. Uh... I mean, I like it. It's it's just good enough to keep getting into. The cards are really nice. The on card ones are pretty sweet. I mean. The names have been coming through just solid enough. You know, if it was like that much cheaper, it'd be better. But I mean, just you know, foot, football is hot, so it's. It's hard. But I do like it and uh, hope to. Uh, They just randomly, I randomly give them out to like everybody that's in the breaks, that's in the break, Seabart in general. Like the, you know, like the, the leaders cards and that kind of stuff just, just go out, go out randomly as evenly to everybody as, as I can uh, do them. Unless they're numbered. If it's like a numbered or a black or something like that, then I would, uh, do like a, a, a legitimate random for that. Yeah, the rookie tickets are the are are the hot piece, Terry. I do agree with that. But it is nice that there's at least one on card like in every box. Yeah, dude, I think I mean once you see them like in person, like it's you know, it's a thicker stock than just like a chrome. Or like thicker than what they've been like in the past. So they do look really nice. Even more so in person. Oh, Jamie, what what'd you end up with? A DJ Chark and a Hines. Chark and Hines. Oof. That's a little rough. That's a little a little rough. Wait, what cards did you donate? I might have missed that in some bleary eyed confusion.
the very least, these are Topps packs, so they are easy to open. Oh, I have them. I mean, this is $25 now. Once you hang on to them for a little bit and, uh, you know, one of those rookies takes that uh, sophomore jump, you're probably going to be looking at like a, you know, like another um, Mahomes style situation. You know, Mahomes wasn't uh, stupid fire hot his, uh, his rookie year. Whoa, what's this? A poster for the Miami Marlins. There's going to be at least two guys in Optic, in Optic this year that people are going to be like, why didn't I buy that team when it was so cheap and I could have gotten his stuff like for nothing? Seaver, you can ask a long question. Oh, yeah, random. Yeah, sure. Ask any question that you would like. What cards are you missing? I actually have like a a partial set myself. That I'm like pretty, uh, pretty like excited about. Because they're actually autographed by the artist that did the, did the, did the pictures. Are people just wanting like foolish dollars on eBay for them or are they even like even selling them on eBay? Oh, it's that. Uh Hang on, let me let me finish opening these packs, and I think the stack that I have here is uh, is handy. I'll see, I'll see what numbers I've got. No, I got to 25, 13, and 19. Sorry, I can't help you with that. What well, I would have liked to, would have liked to. Let's go through these. A uh, Ken Holtzman for the Cubs.
Well, when when Walton becomes the next Barry Sanders, nobody's gonna care. Billy Harris for the Royals. A uh, Glover Torres for the Yankees. Stramsky, Red Sox. Juan Soto for the Nationals. And I won't uh, go as far to open all this up, but a uh, Starlin Castro for the Marlins. Wow, they are going for ridiculous dollars. And we got a David Price for the Red Sox. Red, Red Sox starting out all right. How was uh, Chris Sale? Was he? Like where, where? Like was he at like a like a show or something that uh, you got him to do it at? And a Francisco Lindor scratch, dude. That's nice. Like I, I love to hear stories about like you know players being like good dudes. A gold Chris Bryant to five. Gold Bryant, numbered one out of five, eBay 101. Nice card for the Cubs. I swear some of these cards look action-y, but in fact are not action-filled. There. 
Yeah, see, I've always been, like, too nervous to ever, like, ask. I asked, I have, I have, like, two autographs from uh, athletes that, uh, that, like, I actually asked for. Um, Matt Turk. Anybody, uh, anybody know who Matt Turk is? Asked him for his autograph. Yeah, I know, but I mean, sometimes, I mean, I, you know, there's been too many stories of, like, athletes who just, like, don't want to sign anything or just, you know, being, like, general a-holes about stuff. The, the punter, Matt Turk, yes. I worked for a couple of years at the uh, Dolphins training camp down here in uh, Davie. And they pretty much told us, like, don't hassle, like, the athletes. Because, like, like, a lot of them, like, will come in and, like, buy stuff, like, for their foundations or whatever. So they were just like, you know, don't, don't ask them for autographs, don't ask them for pictures, like, don't be a, you know, don't be a fan. But, like, Matt Turk was in one day, and I just, like, I figured, like, you know, it wasn't, like, Ricky Williams, like, you know, like, if I'm going to do, if I'm going to ask anybody, it might as well be Matt Turk. So, I got a signed mini helmet from Matt Turk. An Alex Bregman autograph for the Astros. I mean, he's a nice dude. You know who I had, like, who... Like he was like came like multiple times a like a week and just like hung out and chatted was uh, was uh, Jay Fiedler's dad. I remember Jay Fiedler used to be a, a quarterback for the Dolphins. John, that's crazy. I mean, he probably remembers me asking for the autograph. Because I was even, like, I was very ap apologetic about it. I'm like, listen, Mr. Turk, you know, they they told us not to hassle you guys. I'm sorry, but, you know, would you do me, like, the solid of, you know, signing this for me? And he was, like, so he was super cool about it. I was like, yeah, absolutely. Buster Posey. I'd never asked him for an autograph, but Junior Seau was like super, like that's super cool guy. Alfaro. Ricky Williams' girlfriend used to come in quite a bit and like buy stuff. She was super hot. Hey, Jordan Zimmerman, uh, black for the Tigers. It's a fun job. I did do like about the most embarrassing thing ever, uh, dur like during that uh, during that time that I was there. Like, if you were like a Dolphins fan club member, like you got like fifteen percent off your purchase. If you were like a player, then you got like twenty five percent off your purchase. Not not my rules, just how it was. I can't remember the guy's name now, but he would have been like, like I mean, I, I could find him. He's like relatively famous, but like you, you like you never see these guys like without their helmets on, so I didn't recognize him. So like some guy comes up to buy something, and I'm like, oh, are you a fan club member? You know, because you get a discount. And he's like, no, but I'm a player. And I was like, okay. And it was the Dolphins kicker at the time. Felt like a wee, like a wee bit of a uh, a hole for that, but I mean I mean the dude was like I mean maybe maybe six feet tall maybe two hundred pounds, like he he didn't he didn't, he didn't look like the uh, you know six two two seventy five you know piece of rock that I had been seeing uh, walking around.
So I was just like, okay, you get a uh, you get a better discount. Here's your hat. Thank you. Okay, it just looked weird to me, but that is a uh, French text variation for uh, Justin Upton of the Angels. This is top loaded. You see there, it's in French. Lord knows, Lord knows how I caught that. Got to uh, Starlin Castro, Marlins. Not only do you get a poster, but you get a scratch off card as well. Bryce Harbor Chrome to uh, 999. Looks like we're looking at another swatch card here upcoming. And it is Eddie Rosario of the Twins. I do I do clearly remember like the like the pro shop was at like one end of the like practice field and then you walk all the way like down like th like you know past the stands and there was like an entrance into the facility but as soon as like you entered the facility from that side there was like a dining room and then like a like the bathroom the weight room and stuff before you like got into like the like main entrance that you would get to if you went like you know through the through the front door that had like all the Super Bowl trophies and you know shy to like that I remember like the had a lady that I worked with so the ladies weren't allowed to go like through the back entrance but I, I like you know the dudes we had like a key card like thing you just swipe and the door would open whatever and I remember seeing uh, Ricky Williams in like his underwear like, I don't if he was, like, you know, walking from, like, the locker room to somewhere or whatever. But to this day, I have still never seen a more muscular, solid-looking dude in my entire life. It was basically the day that I gave up my dreams of uh, getting in shape and uh, playing in the uh, NFL All right, we got our hot box, Scherzer, Nationals. Arenado. Arietta. Matt Kemp. Black Kyle Hendricks for the Cubs. Benny. Eddie 
Edwin Diaz. A Bryce Harper, no longer of the Nationals. A uh, Max Muncy, straight chromium technology. Brent Crawford Giants. Trey Turner, Nationals. A uh, Trevor Brower for the Indians. Bauer. Bauer. Aguilera. Brewers. Crisell Red Sox. Has a Ramirez Indians. Chris Davis, a Walker Bluler. Ronald Acuna, Junior. Hottery. Manea. Athletics. Hot Boxery. Blake Snell throwing fire at Robinson Cano for the uh, Mariners, scratching it off. A Matt Carpenter, Matthew Carpenter even. Well, yeah, since this one's right on top, I'm just going to pull it out. It's a uh, Nolan Arenado, 22 out of 99. Clubhouse collection, game used, memorabilia, fat stack. A Lindor. A Will Myers. A uh, Yankees rookie stars. Mahraza. Buster Posey. And uh, Mookie Betts. Two more bars. The Joey Vato for the Reds. Rip City Cards at gmail.com. Sievert. And listen, I mean, I'm happy to send them. I mean, like, I mean literally, I'm going to charge you shipping and like three bucks for like the box that it's going to take me to like put it in and like, you know, 20 minutes of my time or whatever. But it just might take me a little while to get to it. But I don't mind. Uh, I don't mind doing it. Yelich action variation. We might have a, a wee lull here after uh, Heritage and uh, Contenders are done. That I'll have some time to to go through it. And we have boxes and boxes of this stuff. And Altuve for the Astros.
Bones. Done it. Justin Anderson. Angels. Black border. Finished the uh, Umbrella Academy today. Uh, the only thing it did was uh, make me uh, completely upset that uh, Season 2 is not uh, available. And if it, get, if it gets picked up on Netflix, which it should... It's going to take 18 months to uh, film a new season. So now I need something else to uh, binge in the meantime. A Bryce Harper to 570. Short, pretty, sort of ish. Eric Hosmer. It's tiny. More tiny than uh, than, a, than a normal card. And number two hundred per normal normalness. It's little. A Francisco Rendor for the Indians. Swatchery. Justin Smook for the uh, Toronto Northern baseball team. Our friends to the north. For the uh, Francisco Lindor of the Indians, a Joey Votto of the Reds, a uh, Nolan Arenado to 99 for the Rockies, a uh, Eddie Rosario for the Twins, an autograph for Alex Bregman of the Astros, and a uh, David Price for the Red Sox. Uh, short prints and uh, other notable cards that we managed to find. Again, all others will be checked. And Eric Hosmer, many to 100. A Yelich action variation. 
a uh, Justin Upton French text variation, and a uh, nice Bryant uh, Chrome to five for the uh, Cubs. So thank you, everybody. We'll start out two.